if you don't make it through this, it's gonna be really, really hard on me. But I want you to know, no matter what happens, I will always take care of Emma and make sure that she has the life and the family that she deserves. Because I found somebody who, who truly loves me. Scott accepts me for who I am and for what I am and all of my faults. And the truth is, I love him too. It's true. And I'm done with JR. I mean, is, is there still something there? Of course there's still something there. I mean, there probably will always be something there, but we're not gonna act on it ever again, so. I mean, I just saw him. I saw him at his beach house and anything could have happened there, but it didn't, nothing happened. It could have, but it didn't, nothing happened. So get some rest, Ryan, and, and get better. But just know that I will always take care of Emma no matter what. And Scott will always take care of us. <sighs> it's me. We have a huge problem. JR found out that you stole Palmer's nanotech project. I I'm at the beach house now trying to make sure that you're safe, but I... I Do I have everything Marissa, honey, what's wrong? It's okay. It's all right. Do I have you what I really want? Marissa? Are you blaming me for what happened to Ryan? No, no, all I'm saying is if you and Ryan are going through something... What does that mean? Did he say that we're going through something? No, but Greenlee, clearly you're on his mind. He's, he's busting out of here to, to get to you. He's calling your name during fits. All I'm saying is if you know what's bothering him, maybe you could put his mind at ease when he wakes up. If he wakes up. If he wakes up? I don't know. I mean, this this could be your last chance to talk to him. You never know. You're back. You miss me? No, not really. Oh, it's good to see you too, Amy. I should have known you both would be here. Ryan's trusty fan club. You know, now is not the time. You know what? For once, you're right. If Ryan wakes up and you're both still here, who am I kidding? Of course you will still be here. Please tell him that I took Emma and brought her home. Hello? Of course we'll tell him. Thank you. Dr. Forrest, dial 118, please. Dr. Forrest, please dial 118. Can I see you? Sure, come on. Bastard. Well, not exactly the happy reunion I was expecting. Well, what should I be happy about, David? That you sabotaged my mother or almost killed her? I did no such thing. Okay, all right, and I'll just take your word for it. All right, you know what? Believe what you want, but for the record, I would never hurt your mother. My conscience is clear. You sure about that? Why don't I give you a minute alone? Thanks. <sighs> okay, Ryan. I know you're not used to hearing this, and God knows I'm not used to saying it, but. 
tell me what to do. Whatever you need, whatever it takes, just name it. It's yours.